hello viewer welcome to today's lesson so today we shall be learning about how to care for oneself which uh, was another topic uh, personal hygiene and then uh, sanitation all right observing personal hygiene and sanitation are very important ways we can live a good and healthy life in this lesson we shall learn how to observe personal hygiene by taking care of our body. So how to take care of oneself? So let's take a look at some of the ways that we can uh, care for our body. So one is regular bathing. So bathing regularly is one of the acts that we can uh, ensure to keep our body uh, clean and uh, healthy so we use our body to do a lot of things we play football and pay we write we draw we clean we run and do a whole lot of activities uh, with our body all these activities can make our body dirty, sweaty, and smelly. If we do not bath, our body will smell and we may contract skin diseases. It is therefore important to bath at least twice a day to keep our body free from germs and dirt. We must take our bath early in the morning when we wake up and in the evening before we go to bed so the need for cleaning the teeth so the teeth is used for biting and chewing food it is always important to brush your teeth every day to keep them healthy and fresh when you brush your teeth, it, the brush removes the small bits of food that are left in the gaps in between your teeth. Brushing your teeth also protects your teeth from germs that can cause tooth decay. You must always brush your teeth in the morning when you wake up. You must also brush your teeth in the evening before going to bed so now let's look at some of the things that we can use in cleaning our teeth so some examples of things that we can use to clean our teeth are the toothbrush and then the toothpaste we use toothbrush and toothpaste to clean our teeth you can also use the chewing stick the chewing stick is chewed in the mouth until it becomes soft. You can then use the softened part to clean your teeth. You can also use the chewing sponge. The chewing sponge is chewed in the mouth until it becomes soft. It is then used to clean the teeth. So these are some of the things that we can use in cleaning our teeth also we must ensure that our fingernails are clean and then short anytime we play or use our hands to work dirt and germs enter our fingernails we must always keep our fingernails clean and short to prevent germs and dirt from entering them the germs can easily enter our mouth anytime we use our hands to eat. The best way to keep our fingernails clean is to cut them short or to keep them short anytime when they are grown. So in the act of ensuring that our nails are short and then clean we must 
avoid biting our fingernails. Anytime you bite your fingernail, the gems in your nails enter into your mouth. This can easily make you sick. Also, we must avoid using razor blades to cut them, our nails. This is because one can uh, cut himself or herself. It is safer to use the nail cutter or the clipper to cut your nails. You can also use a nail file to file and shape your nails to look beautiful always. Also, we must take good care of our hair. Our hair covers our head and also protects our scalp. It is always important to take care of our hair to avoid lice and rashes on our head. Alright, so let's take a look at the steps that we can uh, follow to keep our hair clean. So one, we have to wash the hair with soap and water. And after washing, we have to dry the water that is in the hair by using a clean towel. Also, we can apply hair cream to our hair to keep it smooth and then uh, shiny. We can also brush or comb the hair nicely. You can also keep your hair short by trimming it anytime it is bushy. And also, if you are a girl and you want to keep your hair long, you can have it braided. So once your hair is braided, it will look neat and beautiful. So today we've been able to come up with some of the ways that we can uh, follow to keep our body uh, clean and then healthy. So we talked about some act like bathing regularly, uh, brushing the teeth regularly, uh, cutting our nails when they are grown, and then also ensuring that our hair is clean thereby we can wash it and then trim it when it is bushy we can also braid them to keep it uh, beautiful and then neat so this brings us to the end of uh, the lesson see you some other time